The NPO Almaz S200 Angara, Vega, Dubna, NATO reporting name SAR-5 Gammon, is a very long-range, medium to high-altitude surface-to-air missile system designed in the 1960s to defend large areas from bomber attack or other strategic aircraft. Each battalion has six single-rail missile launchers for the 10.8 meters long missiles and a fire control radar. It can be linked to other, longer-range radar systems. Description The S-200 surface-to-air missile system was designed for the defense of the most important administrative, industrial and military installations from all types of air attack. S-200 provides defeat of modern and advanced aircraft, including air command and control centers, AWACS aircraft, aircraft jamming creation and other manned and unmanned aerial vehicles. The S-200 is an all-weather system that can be operated in various climatic conditions. By 1966, the S-200 was officially accepted into a service in order to replace the failed anti-ballistic missile RZ-25 5ths of a volt 11 DAL. The DAL was assigned the NATO reporting name SAR-5 Griffin before it was cancelled. The first S-200 operational regiments were deployed in 1966 with 18 sites and 342 launchers in service by the end of the year. By 1968 there were 40 sites and by 1969 there were 60 sites. The growth in numbers then gradually increased throughout the 1970s and early 1980s until the peak of 130 sites and 2030 launches was reached in 1980 to 1990. Missiles Each missile is launched by four solid-fueled strap-on rocket boosters. After they burn out and drop away it fires a 5D67 liquid-fueled sustainer rocket engine which burns a fuel called TGO2 salmon, oxidized by an agent called AK27P melange. Maximum range is between 150 km and 300 km, depending on the model. The missile uses radio illumination mid-course correction to fly towards the target with a terminal semi-active radar homing phase. Maximum target speed is around Mach 4. Effective altitude is 300 meters to 20,000 meters for early models and up to 35,000 meters for later models. The warhead is either 217 kilograms high explosive fragmentation triggered by radar proximity fuser command signal, or a 25 knots nuclear warhead triggered by command signal only. Each missile weighs around 7,108 kilograms at takeoff. The system utilizes radio semi-active guidance throughout the missile's flight, which is far more accurate at long range than the command guidance method used by the earlier S-75 DEV and other missiles. The existence of an optional terminal passive radar homing mode for use against AEW aircraft remains unconfirmed. Peak missile speed is around Mach 8 and the single shot kill probability is quoted as 0.85, presumably against a high altitude bomber type target. Main radar system The fire control radar of the S-200 system is the 5N62CWH band radar, whose range is 270 km. It is used for both the tracking of targets and their illumination. Additional radar systems P-14 5th N 84A Tall King, a band early warning radar, 2, 6 RPM, maximum search altitude 46 km, or Big Back E band early warning radar. Cabina 66 5th Sen 87 Back Net or Back Trap E Band Early Warning Radar 3 6 RPM P minus 35 37th Bar Lock Bar Lock B 1000 kilowatts EF Band Target Detection and Tracking Radar 7 RPM Side Net or Odd Pair E Band Height Finding Radar 3 6 RPM
SP15M Squat I 380 kW C band target detection radar versions SU008 Angara with the V-865 of a volt 21 of the 860P 5E21A missile introduced in 1967 range 17 to 180 kilometers ceiling 20 kilometers 0 5 to 40 the probability of hitting the target 0, 45 to 0, 98, S200V, Vega, with the V860PV, 5V21P missile, introduced in 1970, range 240 km, minimum 7 km, ceiling 29 km, superior limit 35, minimum height 0, 05 km, 5 divisions. Division 1 goal and missiles are targets a maximum of 2. Missile has a semi-active radar homing, the launch, a reclining, with a constant angle of elevation, from the launcher, is rotated horizontally, S-200, Vega, with the V-870 missile, range increased to 300 km and ceiling to 40 km with the new, shorter missile and solid fuel motor, the probability of hitting the target 0, 66 to 0, 99. S200M Vega M with the V-885 of a volt 28 of the 880N 5V2A10 squared missile, range 300 km, ceiling 29 km. S200VE Vega E with the V880E 5V2A10 missile, export version, high explosive warhead only, range 240 km, minimum target size of 0.3 square meters speed of the target minus 1200 meters per second the number of simultaneously fired targets up to five greater than previously opportunity fight against stealth s200 d dubna with the 5v25 v v8 a to m 5v2 a tem a v8 a to m n 5v2 a tem n squared missile introduced in 1976 high explosive a nuclear warhead range 400 kilometers ceiling 0 3 to 40 kilometers the probability of hitting the target 0, 72 to 0, 99. Command post S300 can manage in any combination the elements of S200 and S300. Missiles complex S200 Dubna can be controlled command post. System S300. Command post S300 may also be controlled by the command post S400 through a higher level command post. Iranian Air Defense Force has implemented several improvements on their S200 system such as using solid state parts and removing restrictions on working time. They destroyed a UAV target beyond 100 km range in military drill in recent years. They used two new solid propellant missile named SAYYAD-2 and SAYYAD-3 via interface systems TALASH-2 and TALASH-3 in cooperation with S-200 system. These missiles can cover medium and long ranges at high altitudes. Also Iran claims to have developed a mobile launcher for the system. Operators Current operators Russia 2 battalions SU-100 Dubna, Algeria 10, Azerbaijan 15, Bulgaria 1 battalion, India, Iran 10 battalions in service, Kazakhstan, North Korea 4 battalions, 40 systems in 2010. C-125-140, C-75-180, Myanmar 20 launches from North Korea, Poland 2 squadrons, Romania unknown number, Syria 2 defense regiment comprising 2 divisions including 2 batteries S-200 in service as of 2010. S-200VE-48 launchers in 2012 Syrian army constructed new S-200 site at Quaz airport near Aleppo in July 2016.
Turkmenistan, Uzbekistan, former operators Belarus, approximately four battalions, Czechoslovakia five battalions, passed on to successor states, Czech Republic, inherited all Czechoslovak S-200 SAM systems, out of service since mid-1990s. East Germany 4 battalions, Germany 4 battalions former GDR, phased out around 1991. Hungary 1 battalion, asterisk, Libyan Arab Jamahiriya 8 battalions. Moldova 1 battalion, Georgia, Mongolia, the Mongolian People's Army operated SAR-5 systems in 1985, but it is unlikely there are any operational as of 2011, Ukraine, last division was retired on October 30, 2013. Soviet Union, originally deployed with the ZAPVO in the strategic air defense role, it was phased out starting in the 1980s and passed on to the successor states before the phasing out process could be completed. Dot. Incidents involving the S-200 Siberia Airlines Flight 1812, a Ukrainian S-200 accidentally locked onto a Topolev Tu-154 passenger aircraft when the target drone the missile was aimed at was destroyed by another missile. The airliner was destroyed over the Black Sea on 4 October 2001, killing all 78 people on board.